be asking students how the recession in Nigeria has been affecting them and we want to see their reply how is the recession affecting you as a student still in federal university we will be going around to our students on how the recession has been affecting them come with me hello mr how are you sir and um, which department are you in federal university of Tweke? can you speak up a little please english and communication studies english and communication studies now as a student in federal university of Tweke, or let's say as a student in general how has the recession in nigeria be affecting you as a student uh, I can say that in our economy now, it of course, uh, economy stability in our country. That is, if you if you talk about economy stability, it is, we talk about economy downfall. That is our our leaders now. You know, they have to put heads together, not relying in foreign maybe exporting uh, foreign made products. You know, this may be enforcing our agricultural uh, sector for them to produce. Like, unemployment now is the... Of course, a lot of uh, unemployment. If a lot of crime, a lot of law, uh, robbery and corruption. There is one case that the weakness is in the last three months, uh, the, uh, advanced the kidnapper. So now, you know, as a student now, in the area of... Uh, Maybe how they used to send money for me before. It will not be how uh, it have affects my parents. Maybe in their job, in their businesses. Uh, so how they normally send money to me before. Maybe now it have reduced. Maybe if I call them before now, they will say letter, letter, letter. I don't have cash now. They will say that is dollar rate. So that is the order of the day. So that is all I want to say. Okay, so that is actually how the recession is affecting as a student. Yes, yeah, a student. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Good morning, sir. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm fine. Um, which department are you in Federal Engineering? Petroleum and Gas Engineering. Petroleum and Gas Engineering, yes. Okay, so as a student in Federal University of Tweke, okay. how has the, the recession been affecting you? That is what we get when the hope pejoratively obnoxious with the local police. Nigerians have been bamboozled, razzle-dazzled, razzmatazz politically. Then I ask myself this political question. It's not the same man who worked over electric country in 2011. It's not the same man whose particular name is never understood to vote in 2015. Where I said he was super clarified, fatalistic, expelitious. I know you're wondering, you're wondering, the meaning of super clarified expelitious. Super clarified expelitious is a way of saying the phenomenon fantastic. But particularly, let me say, it was being attacked of what I describe as neo mono ultra macroscopic silicovulcanoconiosis. It is a word that somebody calls silicosis, meaning a lung disease. But in search for the longest one in the dictionary, they pep it up to become a 45 liter horse, which is neo mono ultra macroscopic silicovulcanoconiosis. That was all the thing he was being attacked of. But we insisted, we voted him. He got victory. Today, what to get in return, what to get in appreciation is the colossal, kakatoa, homongous and determined fair price. High cost of living. High cost of living. What an opprobrium. What an odium. What a political palony. What a political palu. Look at this. In 2012, the same society of accumulation and public duration was condemned by a scrupulous, fastidious, postenica, energetic and a rooty tutti governor Adam Soshemole, who was once the voice of the masses, but today for party affiliation, sentiment, for political sonabolism and malnutrition, they are choosing to remain close mountain. Resistant, uncommunicative and unforthcoming. Meaning he has cotoned in their power. This is sardonic, appropriate, contumelous, malevolent and aspirating. What a political palio. What a political popular paradise. At this point, I would like to borrow the words of the grace, Sasuke Pedelia, Logomena, Igodomigo of Edo State. That it is crystal clear, like the public can't Lufasin, that this administration has no blueprint on social economic matters. But our advice is to tell Mr. President that following the decision and pedigree, I know him, he can do better. With the consternation, I ask he accept my pertinacious to so collusion. 
I said my potential to Nampagos can look west and my look west. At this point, I refuse to koto in his poho. I refuse to koto in their poho. Thank you very much. So all these things you've just said, it's just concerning the recession affecting you as a student. Yes. All of these things you've just said. Yes. Thank you very much, sir. It's nice talking to you.